I'm an adult! It's not in focus on it's you. It's okay, the food is what matters! Hey, it's been a while. Like, a long while. Like, look at this kitchen. It's a different kitchen. Also, the uh, pandemic happened and is still happening. Get vaccinated if you are able and haven't yet. Uh, what are you waiting for? A lot has happened since the last time I saw you. I moved. I got married. Check out my wedding ring. It's like a quarter size too big, so I have a little spacer that I need to keep it from falling off. I also got more bald. Check out my bald spot. It's getting bigger. It's fun. Real estate. It's going. Get in now before it's all gone. Anyway, eating is a cool, healthy, and fun way to not die, so let's do some of that. This is going to be super simple and quick. Here's what you need. Some flank steak, here already in a bag marinating. Some potatoes, some onions, steak sauce, teriyaki sauce, some salt and pepper, and that's it. I mean, you'll need some water or milk and like pots and pans and an oven and stuff, but generally ingredients lists don't like list those. Okay, uh, first let's marinate our steak. I already did that yesterday off camera, but Here's a Ziploc bag and a Chespin plushie. Put your steak in the bag, then pour in some steak sauce and teriyaki sauce, however much you like. Once in there, get most of the air out of the bag, sluice things around a little, then uh, put it in the fridge for at least an hour, preferably overnight. Then we're going to cut up our onions and potatoes like so. I like to keep the potato skins on. I'm a skins guy. Potato skins, kiwi skins, pork rinds. Eat skins. Skins are good for you. Don't eat the onion skins, because that's like, I don't know, it's like leaves, basically. It's like hard and coarse and lacks moisture. Put your potatoes in boiling water and let cook until soft. Some folks like to boil their potatoes in pre-salted water, but I like to wait until the end to add salt to taste. Onion time. Add a little bit of oil to a pan. I'm using sesame oil here, and toss your onions in. Let them sit for a while, no need to stir. We want them to brown a little and build up some fond in the pan. Every once in a while, give them a toss. They should get translucent and char a bit. Add some steak sauce and teriyaki sauce to the pan now. Turn the heat on low and let simmer. Back in potato land, once your potatoes are soft, like a fork goes right through them soft, strain them and return to the pot. Add a tablespoon of butter, then mash. Add some milk, I'm using oat milk here. This is the point where you'd add salt and pepper to taste. Cover and let sit. Prep the steak. Line a pan with foil and pat your steak dry. Salt and pepper on both sides. Set your broiler to high and broil for five minutes on both sides. Occasionally sit in front of uh, your oven and pretend you're a contestant on the Great British Baking Show. You could also probably see my bald spot again. Once done, remove and let sit for at least five minutes. While that's going on, get some mashed potatoes on a plate, add your salty, oniony goodness, then after your five minutes, cut some steak and enjoy. Also make a second plate of food because your wife is going to be mad at you because it took so long. I know I said this was going to be quick, and generally it is, but because I had to keep on moving cameras around and the setup in the beginning anyway was already annoying, you know, we want to we want to eat food now, and I love my wife, and we're gonna have we're gonna have dinner now. But uh, it's quick and fast, and a speedy cleanup. Oh, also regarding cleanup, I have a dishwasher now, and a washer and dryer. Life is uh, super different uh, than the last time I saw you, and I hope everyone is doing well. See you next time, whenever that is.